Institute of Professional Bloggers of Nigeria pays a cost of receipt to the Commission of Information and Strategy, Honorable Steve Ayorinde, to introduce the aim and objective of the GATE. And the entire management staff of this ministry will welcome you on this courtesy visit. It's indeed a great pleasure to have you around. Thank you very much. Commissioner Honorable Commissioner, um, executives of the ministry, uh, once again, uh, we wish to thank you all for the opportunity given us to be here. The main objective of our coming here is to meet you with the, uh, the activities of our, our session and so that we can be able to set some kind of ethic, ethical standard. The Honorable Commissioner, the person of Mr. Steve Ayorodi. So let's go find out what he has to say about Guild of Bloggers. Let me uh, join the Permanent Secretary of the Ministry and the Directors here present and other members uh, of the team from our Ministry to formally welcome you to the Ministry of Information and Strategy, Lagos State. Uh, the mere fact that um, this, shall I say historic, um, <laughs> uh, visit is happening at this time means that the Lagos State Government, uh, through the Ministry of Information and Strategy, uh, recognizes your association or your guild, as you have put it. Um, and therefore, um, we feel very honored too uh, that you deemed it fit to consider this ministry the first uh, of, I believe, the sort of visitations that you'll be carrying out. Uh, let me first start from um, what we consider to be important to us, which, uh, as you will see in your um, relationship with the ministry later um, you see why uh, we have accepted to um, welcome you and to partner with you uh, like the permanent secretary said uh, the issue of ICT uh, digital technology and lately social media is very very important to uh, the Lagos State Government um, in the past, before uh, Mr. Kimambodi became the governor, and uh, and then the leadership of the military ministry changed to, if you like, uh, core professionals. Uh, the ICT department used to be a main unit uh, dealing with issues of website and uh, information technology, uh, but um, we thought it was necessary to flow with the tide. Um, because nobody can ignore the efficacy of the digital technology at this time. So uh, we proposed to His Excellency the Governor, and it was of course duly approved that that unit should uh, be upgraded into the status of a full directorate uh, headed by a director, and which is why today you have the um, Department of ICT and Social Media, headed by a full director, Mr. Tayo Akoli. So, um, so we shouldn't just think that it's about the platform, because no single blogger, no single individu individual owns that platform, you know. And established media organizations too can lay uh, a veritable claim on a good chunk of the space that uh, you know online media provides. And which is one of the driving uh, spirits of why Lagos State, for example, you know, has embraced uh, the use of social media uh, as one of our key areas. We believe, of course, that 65% of those that we need to communicate to at any given time will be found online. But where online? Because online is like it's like the world itself. Is it the United States part of, 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 of the online world? Is it the UK part? Is it the Lagos you know, aspect of it? And guess what? All these things are verifiable. You know, you know uh, 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 where people are at any point in time. You know their demographic. You know their gender. You know, you know the sort of stories that they want. And therefore, it shouldn't be enough just to be a blogger, but to be familiar uh, with how even blogging uh, as you know, is, is functioning 
um, online. Uh, we believe that we also have enormous resources within our disposal, you know, to push out our news. If you look at the followership that our website and our social media platforms alone, add that to the followership that His Excellency the Governor has, and then add that to more than 200 ministries, parastatas, and agencies of the state, you see that uh, within our disposal alone, if we um, use our platforms alone, at any point in time to push out our news and information, add the LTV, add the radio stations, and their online, huge online machinery, we believe that uh, at any point in time we'll be speaking with between 35 to 55 percent of Lagosians. I'm going to bring Mr. Steve on the hot seat, and he's here with me. Mr. Steve, how are you? I'm fine, very well. You're looking amazing. What's the secret? I don't do so much when it comes to um, fashion or you know fashion regimen, beauty regimen. I'm very modest. Right, so tell us, so how long have you been a journalist? Okay, well, I was a journalist for 24, about 23, 24 years before uh, this appointment last year. But of course, being a commissioner for information is also media related. So I don't think that um, there's any dichotomy. So is there any particular thing you have done to deserve being appointed a commissioner? Uh, <laughs> I would think, I would think that um, uh, you know the governor had his reasons for picking um, you know his cabinet members. Uh, but don't forget the fact that I also uh, worked with him as his director of media and. Um, communications. And also, do you know he was the MD National Mayor when I was uh, doing my uh, personal assistant? Please, that's an information for another day. So you welcome to uh, give the bloggers not too long. What's your take on that? Well, I mean, I salute the fact that um, bloggers have decided to come together um, to professionalize, uh, to say that uh, the bad old days of people doing whatever they liked uh, the bad old days of people suspecting that bloggers are essentially um, uh, opportunities of blackmailers, you know, that those days are gone. Uh, I like the fact that uh, people recognize that now, yes, uh, social media is just a platform, but uh, ethical responsibility is also important. And therefore, we, you know, open our doors to them at the Ministry of Information and Strategy, Lagos State, uh, to say that, yes, there is no harm in uh, working together, there is no harm in uh, uh, building the nation and the state together. Uh, the biggest job of the editor is not necessarily knowing what to publish, but knowing what not to publish. My name is Steve Ayonride, Honorable Commissioner for Information and Strategy, Lagos State. Keep watching Bodex TV. One Lagos, love Lagos. <laughs>